All right, guys, today's the day. We're getting the benches in here and the cabinets. Um, I don't know where. I want to do a time lapse, but I don't know. Oh, it's back there. I'm going to do the time lapse right now, uh, but you guys have already had the explanation before, so <laughs> let's see how these things get installed. <laughs> Well, what do you think? I know that doesn't look like much now, but this sure does look like something. I don't know much about cabinets, so I'm going to let the pro do all the work. I think he needs a little assist here. And uh, this, is what, this is what we're looking like right now. So we added three little holes on the side for electricity. I'm going to have a shelf with uh, power outlets per shelf so that, you know, if people come by, they can charge their laptop and whatever else. So, uh, but otherwise, it is quickly coming together. The bus almost looks, well, after these uh, cabinets are in, we're going to look like we're half constructed here. Very exciting. Justin mostly did this job. He is the pro. Uh, I learned a little bit how cabinets are installed and you know mounted and all that stuff. Uh, did a couple, as you guys may have seen from the time lapse, may have not, depending on what I cut out of there. Um, but <laughs> within the blink of an eye, seriously, within the blink of an eye, this took all of I don't know, maybe a half an hour. It looks like half the bus is installed, and it's going to look even better once we put the front face. See, this one's already attached there with a little power port right there. Um, but yeah, like even once the face part of this is installed and that, it's just really gonna come to life really, really quickly. Um, so let me just give you a quick walkthrough. Uh, this is the YouTube cabinet. Every uh, shelf has a, uh, a power port with uh, two USBs. Uh, it's a little shelf. I think this one pulls out. Uh, that's a, a door. Shelf. Doors. Steve's got the front part of those, although we can't install those until the plywood is on. I think we're going to do that. Um, this is the sink area with a false front, obviously, because you can't pull out you know, your sink. Uh, two uh, cabinet drawers here, and then this is where the 12 volt Dometic or uh, a 12 volt fridge goes. I'm not sure which one I'm getting quite yet, but uh, that's how that is going down. And then this is a uh, what is that closet? How's that working? I forget. Oh, yeah, full closet to this window. Well, actually, window and a half ish, and that part back is bed. So that could be the wall. I haven't quite... Well, the wall's over there. We're gonna match, make the wall match up and then all bed. Break it into thirds and all that fun stuff. You probably heard me talk about that before. The ceiling is looking epic. This bus just came together within about a half an hour. Yeah. Well, minus the two weeks of work. <laughs> it's all in the prep. Yes. Build the cabinets outside. You do it right, you slide right into place. Enchanté. Oh, that's what you were thinking. Gotcha. Daily question. So uh, this is, I wasn't sure exactly how they were going to put this together, but uh, now I know they are basically putting it right to the 2x4. Yeah, <laughs> And that just goes flush with the uh, those 2x4s. And uh, then there will be another piece of 
plywood that becomes the bottom of the bench. And then we left a little space down below to be the um, <clears throat> area where you can pull out a uh, a table. So if people want uh, custom cabinets when you're on the road in their adventure rigs, are you going to offer your services? Of course. All right. How can people people find you? Uh, Mojo-bus.com. You can shoot me an email from there. All right. Perfect. Wow. Look at that. Just like that, it's put together. Yeah, that's a, that's a really nice look there with the uh, shaker, so it matches all the, the kitchen stuff. Yeah. I see, I, see, I see what you guys did there, and I like it. <laughs> so this is about as far as we are getting install-wise. We don't really have anything else to install, just a couple little mods, but it's the end of the day. We've been working like, I don't even know, me and Steve have been at this for like three weeks. You guys close to two weeks, I think. So I'm gonna take these guys out for some barbecue and some beers right down the street. Uh, I just wanna say thank you for your help. Steve, Justin, Renee, you guys are amazing. I never thought two strangers and Steampunk Steve would show up here and help me build it. Wait a minute, I'm stranger than them. <laughs> Very true, and my, it looks like I'm gonna run out of battery. I don't know if it caught that. But